My mission with the Division of Forestry is to make sure that everybody gets to enjoy the natural resources as much as I do. State forests offer Hoosiers, at, at a minimal level, an opportunity to get out and experience the outdoors. You can come have a picnic, you can bike ride, you want to go backpacking, whatever you want to do, your state forests offer you an opportunity. It's important to remember that the forest resources aren't just the timber and the trees out there. I mean, it includes things like protection of the water resources, the soil, the wildlife. It's multiple things. Pretty much any forest management operation we do affects forest wildlife habitat. And my job with the division is to provide guidance to ensure that we're providing good habitat we're not endangering any species. All the researchers tell us that if you want to support a very diverse wildlife population, the best way to do it is to provide a variety of different forest habitats. And the best way to do that is through a variety of different forest management activities. It could be prescribed burning, it could be a timber harvest that thins the stand. They're, these are public lands and they do belong to the citizens of Indiana, taxpayers of Indiana, so they have every right to take an interest in what goes on. I think the main question they probably have is simply how can cutting trees improve the forest? I often compare it to weeding a garden, you know, and the result is it can have the same effect that it does in the garden. It can result in improved uh, growth and health of the remaining trees. Right now, they might put a log carrot up on top of the road, but they might put Visitors are going to notice a difference in the forest immediately after a timber harvest. You're going to notice stumps, you're going to notice tops. These are all great for critters. So you need little plants, you need ferns, you need moss. Whatever you can do to increase the diversity of the habitat, it's going to increase your diversity of species. You study, say, the bird community prior to a timber harvest in an area. Um, and for timber harvest, we're talking about a thinning of the trees and maybe some small regeneration openings. The species diversity will go up. When you have high species diversity in a forest, uh, you have resiliency. That forest is better able to withstand pests infestation. Uh, it's a healthier forest. You know, we've been doing this for over 100 years and these forests are still here. They're still productive, healthy, diverse, beautiful forests. Our intention is to keep it that way 100 years in the future. It is my job to make sure that all of this is here for future generations and everybody can enjoy it.